Since the victory against West Virginia, the first set was a struggle. The next three obviously went a lot better. What happened in the first set? Uh, that's a good question. If uh, we could substitute six, maybe we would have there. No, uh, it was a combination of things. The Jayhawks weren't plugged in and taking care of their side of the net. And uh, West Virginia was valuing their opportunity and played great. And um, thank goodness, as you, as you mentioned, we got things turned around a little bit in the set, second set and uh, controlled the match pretty well after that. But uh, uh, you, you don't want to have to rely on that. Obviously, you want to get off to a better start. But the start wasn't great, but the response after that was very good. Yeah, you had nine errors in the first set, but then only two in set number two and only four. So you had six errors combined over those next two sets. What changed offensively to the efficiency? Well, it was about uh, the, they were serving us off the court in the first set, and our first pass didn't allow us to set Taylor or Jarmok or Dockery. We became very predictable. Uh, and then our passing improves in the second set, and then obviously your offensive efficiency improves. I think we hit zero the first set and then hit over 400 the second set. So that's just a reflection of of us getting the ball to Aaron so she could make some good choices. And Catherine Carmichael, her hitting efficiency dipped a little at the end, but she was above 400 for most of the match, finishes with a team high of 15 kills. What about her performance? Yeah, she was, uh, she'd be the first to say she got off to a little bit of a slow start too, just with getting into the feel of the match. But uh, we stuck with her and uh, she responded well. So took some high level swings uh, as the match went along. 3-0 and in conference play for the first time in program history. What does that mean to you? Uh, that means we need to get ready for Baylor. Uh, because they're a very good team, and I know they're very hungry to get uh, the Big 12 off to a good start for them too. So, but yeah, it's a it's obviously a good start. Two of those wins on the road. So, uh, we'll go back to work tomorrow and get ready for Saturday.